Hey there guys, it's Luke here, your digital concierge with Gramophone. Today we're going to take a look at Dan Clark Audio's newest edition of their open back Aeon headphone. This is the Aeon Flow 2. Already the winner of multiple awards, the Aeon Flow 2 are the much awaited successor to the original Aeon Flow 1, which were renowned for their combination of superb ergonomics, excellent sonic performance, high reliability, and best of all, great value. So today, it is my pleasure to be able to take you guys and dive in to what makes the Aeon Flow 2 a worthy upgrade and a headphone that you've absolutely got to consider if you're searching in this category. But before we get into all of that, make sure you subscribe to the Gramophone channel and click that bell notification icon because we've got a lot of great content on the way for you guys. More headphones, tech products, great speakers, you name it, it's coming. Don't want to see any of you guys miss out. Now then, the Aeon Flow 2 and why they're exceptional. The driver in the Aeon 2 is 100% proprietary to Dan Clark's design. There is no off-the-shelf parts here. It is all designed and manufactured by them. And that is a great thing, because that's how you know you're getting a genuine product that's actually going to be unique. That planar driver is a 62 by 34 millimeter driver, which is huge, at least when you think about it compared to your average dynamic driver. Dynamic meaning like comb and dome style. This being a flat surface cut across almost this whole portion right there is a whole lot of surface area for audio performance. And this is actually tech inspired by the Ether 2 headphone, which is a Dan Clark model that cost more than twice that of this headphone. So you know some seriously good tech has been integrated into this. And that is a single-ended planar design, meaning you have a magnet on just one side, leaving the other almost completely open. The transducer in this unit, that planar element, is also very, very efficient as there has been reduced weight with this unit due to the design of the magnet structure, so it's very easy to power. And finally, it's built using what's called V-Planar processing. The planar film inside this, the actual business end of the driver moving the air, has been lightly textured on this surface. That actually helps increase bass performance and further cuts down on distortion. This is also built around a design language called True Flow version 2, which is designed to maximize airflow through the motor structure. The more airflow, the better. You have less in the way, you get better clarity, and that plays into the efficiency of the headphone as well. Finally, that all comes together to give you a total harmonic distortion out of this headphone at 0.3%, which would be a, an impressive number in any right, but that's throughout the entire audible range, from 20 hertz to 20 kilohertz. That is quite something. All right, so first and foremost, let's talk about how these are constructed. The headband is a nickel titanium, so it's very durable, but very light. The body, or the baffles rather, these are basically carbon fiber. So again, explains why it's so lightweight and has actually a really cool kind of feel to it as well. Uh, looking at your ear cups, these are actually a synthetic protein leather made in Japan that you'll notice is sealed all around the outside, but is on the front edge, if you flip these around, actually perforated to let a little bit of energy out the front edge, which is kind of interesting. Also, while these are a synthetic leather, they are very convincing. I actually thought they were real leather until I read that. So, well done on that synthetic leather selection. You had me fooled. And these weigh a measly 328 grams. So, all of these features come together to make a headphone that is very impressively comfortable, where almost every element of its design serves not only comfort, but of course, the sound performance. With great materials like carbon fiber, nickel titanium, and of course the fact that this is an open back planar magnetic, which already makes it kind of unique, this is quite the offering. And here's a really cool feature. Lastly, they have this folding gimbal design that is patented by Dan Clark, so they can fold into themselves, now they're super portable. The ingenuity that went into that from Dan Clark, that's impressive. Well done guys, well done. 
This uses, at the headphone end, a four-pin bayonet connector. This entire cable, of course, is removable, and if you wanted to buy a different cable to get something better, for example, that's entirely possible. Just make sure you terminate it four-pin bayonet. On the other side of the standard cable, though, it's a three and a half millimeter cable. However, note the threads on this connector so that it will easily be adapted to quarter inch using a screw-on adapter. It's pretty standard and straightforward, but that's precisely what we want as these are the most common connector types for headphones. For under $1,000, the Aeon Flow 2 open back headphones by Dan Clark Audio are an exceptional piece and a wonderful addition to a headphone collection for the audiophile in us all. And we here at Gramophone are really proud to be able to offer products like these by Dan Clark. If you guys want any more information on this particular model or anything else by Dan Clark Audio, go to gramophone.com or give us a call at one of our showroom locations in Timonium, Columbia, and Gaithersburg, Maryland. Also, don't forget to check out our Kitchen Design Center in Hunt Valley. You can also now find us on social media. Be sure to check us out over on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and LinkedIn, as well as a handful of others. Check the links down below. If you need help coming up with project ideas, need to schedule a service request, or would just like to speak to one of our hi-fi home theater and interior design experts, get inspired at gramophone.com. If you have any questions for me about anything that we've covered here on the channel, ask at gramophone.com. I'd love to help you out. All right, guys, you know what's up. Give us a like if you enjoyed this video, put a comment down below, and subscribe to the Gramophone channel for all of your audio and home theater needs. And of course, I wanna hear back from you guys. Tell me what you think of Dan Clark and what you think of the Aeon Flow 2s. Also, tell me what you wanna see from us in the future. I love doing this for you guys. It's a ton of fun, so I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you for watching. Be seeing you.